I kid you not. What's up, Money Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, I want to show you guys how to invest your first $100 in using the Weibo app. So I've talked about Weibo here on the on the channel a lot. So if you haven't already um, checked out the platform, I'm gonna put a link in the description below so you can definitely uh, go check that platform. And if you use that link, they'll give you two free stocks to get you started. Um, one for just opening an account with them and then another stock for depositing um, any amount. I think if you deposit $100 uh, or $50, whatever, you get another free stock. So two free stocks are getting you started. Um, and in return for you, doing that for me I also get free stock so just for full transparency um, it's an affiliate link so uh, we're gonna jump in here and take a look at the platform and see what they have to, to offer um, remember I've actually done a video here uh, complaining about how Robinhood is not set up for day trading um, it's actually set up for for people that do swing trading or for just people that are long-term investors and so I've been like really researching on Weibo as well as uh, Tink or Swim to really see See where I want to focus my effort um, as far as my day trading experiment goes I call it an experiment because you never know um, so we're gonna jump in there and uh, today for Weibo my goal is to focus specifically on the mobile app so uh, the mobile app the layout is a little bit different from what you find on the desktop app um, I think the desktop app is I mean I love the layout on the desktop app but again everybody is mobile these days so um, we should definitely take a look at the mobile app and if at some point I do have time I might do a video um, on the desktop app just going to show you guys or um, if I start using that particular desktop app for day trading I'll probably just do a video showing you guys how everything works out in that in that um, app so let's jump in and um, just see what the app actually has to offer um, when you first launch Weibo it's going to bring you to this home screen um, as you can see here it, it shows you um, you know it shows your account number it shows your positions um, and uh, a lot of more information so um, at the very bottom of the screen here you would see that it has your, your watch list it has the, the market and then your community and then some other menu uh, options so there's a lot of stuff going on in here so we're gonna just take a look at this um, just uh, one after another so if we start with the watch list so this is where you can actually um, track the stocks that you care about so when you do research and you see a stock that you like you can come here and add it to this list and the beauty about this list is that you can actually customize it into maybe different sectors or uh, different markets so let's say for instance um, right here so I have uh, different watch list I have one that is just called my watch list that has everything and then I have another one or multiple ones that have um, different um, positions that or different stocks that I'm watching so my position will show you the position I have on there and then if we go back so you have our stocks under ten dollars stocks under twenty dollars stocks under thirty dollars I have pharmaceutical I have technology energy oil and gas healthcare ETFs real estate um, you can that list can go um, as far as you want it um, depending on your your personal needs so this is this is really good uh, so again if you just go down here say add uh, list if you just click on that you can give the name of the list um, and just put something in there and start start tracking it which is really good it keeps you nice and organized so if you go to market it shows you the different the different markets so you have the United States you have crypto and you have the global market so look at it shows you all around the globe which is awesome this is just I, I mean at your fingertips this is great information right there at your fingertips so if you care about crypto uh, from Bitcoin to Ethereum and all that good stuff then United States it shows you the Dow Jones um, S&P and Nasdaq so um, again there's so much information there um, if you see here it's showing you your top gainers for the day um, and then if you scroll down a little bit it shows you your top losers for the day uh, and then see most active stocks that got traded today so CCL um, got traded a lot today which is um, which is crazy um, and then GE as well and then hardest ETFs and then so hey guys there's so much information here that you can benefit from so that's the, the, uh, that tab and then if we go to um, this meter tab here this is like your account this is where 
you as the owner you can see your board so um right now it's showing you my position and then um so if i want to do a quick trade i can just click on click trade um you have a uh, performance and deposit and all that good stuff so i have two positions and they're not doing really good so but i'm not worried about it it's long term so um, i have two positions in there and um you can look at this chart from a, a, a one month view a three months view um, a, a six month view, a, a year to date view, or a one year view. So those are different options that you can see. So if we if we just take this back to five days, so this is a five a five day view that you, you're seeing right here on the screen, and this is my positions. So if you go, if you have open positions, let's say you put a limit order and you're waiting for that to kind of fill, that would show up under um, open orders. So which is good. So right now I don't have any open orders. Um, and then um, if you go to the community tab, this is where you have people talking about what's happening, different um, traders talking about uh, what's going on and sharing their ideas. And, you know, just basically, um, you know, giving your opinion as to what's going to happen, stocks that they're looking at buying um, and what they think is hot. What I think it's good, you know, you meet, meet with other people and just kind of exchange ideas. Um, it's, it's really great. Um, and then so if you go under the menu here, this will bring you to your home screen. And um, so you have other things that you can actually see here. Um, that's really great. So if we go back uh, here, uh, again, this is these are my positions that I have. Uh, if I want to do a quick trade, if I just click on that, and then I can search for whichever stock that I, I want, let's say you want Apple, um, and just watch this gonna come up. And then you have the option to buy Apple. And so you can do either a limit, a market, a stop, Oh, one other one here is this one is called uh, OTO. If you place an order and you want them to go in a sequence, um, you can actually set that sequence here. And then uh, once one of the other executes, it's going to trigger the other ones to execute in that exact same sequence like you, you wanted them. So that's a really good feature that I, I kind of found here that you can actually use. So, um, so let's say if you do a limit order and there you can pick it. Um, here's one thing that I love about uh, Weibo that Robinhood doesn't have. You see this feature down here. It says take profit and stop loss. This feature doesn't exist in in, in um, Robinhood. And so Robinhood, you have to place your order. And once that order gets executed, they think you can run back in and go do uh, stop loss or take profit. You cannot do both in Robinhood. You can only do one or the other. So which is kind of crazy but here you can do both at the same time so i kind of like it so yeah if you if you go in a position say ten dollars and you say oh i'm, I'm ready to to you know take a loss of five cents per share uh but i want to take a profit of two dollars so you can set that up even before you hit buy this is a really good feature so i i love it and that's one of the reasons why i'm really considering uh, moving all my day trading assets into uh Weibo. Uh, and then, so if you look at here, if you have any open orders, it would show here at the moment, I don't have any open orders. Um, again, like I said, you have limit, market, stop, and OTO. Um, and then um, here is another area where you can do, um, you know, just, it just kind of shows you more information about your particular position. But this is for people that are doing options. And I'm not an option trader, so don't even, don't even ask me any questions about that. Um, so there's one other thing that I really want to show you guys here that I, I think I like as far as uh, research. So if you go under um, your watch list, let's say, for instance, um, I pick my watch list here. Um, let's pick any stock. Let's say Trinity Biotech. You open that. So if you look here, um, this is the stock. It's showing you. You see it gives you the news. Um, it shows you comments that people are talking about. Um, it shows you if it's, if it's a kind of like a bullish or a bearish uh, stock. Uh, right now, if you see 89% uh, bullish and 11% and bearish, which is awesome. And then it gives you some sort of analysis. See, if right here they're telling you all analysts are saying it's a strong buy. Um, and then here, <clears throat> excuse me, so you have the profile of the stock that you can actually read, um, just get a better understanding of what this stock does. So. This is, this is great. So um, I really love this app and, and I think it's for you that's just starting out. Um, there's so much information in here that might get people confused, but once you get a hand of it, trust me, um, it's, it's really, really good. Um, compared to Robinhood, Robinhood is a lot simpler. 
um, for somebody that doesn't want to learn a lot. If you just want straightforward things, Robinhood is good. But this app has a ton of information that can definitely benefit you uh, trading. So um, this video was actually how to invest your first $100 in Webull. So now let's go ahead and do that. So we, we're going to pick a stock and then we'll see how we can invest it, right? Um, in this case, you can pick the, uh, multiple stocks, but I'm just going to pick one stock. Um, so let's see if we do a quick trade. Um, let's look for ticker symbol BA. Uh, that is Boeing Company. Um, as of right now, um, they are sitting at about $131.49. So um, I don't have $139.41. Um, and Webull hasn't given me the options to do fractional share trading. So that kind of sucks. So I have to go look for another stock that uh, might trade, um, let's say, um, under $100. So let me go back to my watch list. Uh, I'm going to pick, uh, let's go under energy. And let's see, we can pick uh, something like, let's say ET. So, and then, so if I want to buy ET, um, all I have to do is I can say trade and it would bring up my trading window. And so if you see, I have $120 and some change as far as my buying power. So um, the current price is um, 502. And so I can I can either set a limit order to buy it at that price, or I can set a market order. To, I set a limit order to buy it at the price either lower or higher than that, or I can set a market order to buy it at exactly that price. So in this case, I'm gonna set um, a limit order so to buy it at say uh, five dollars. So if you see drop down to five dollars, then I'm gonna buy it. Then I'm gonna say give me ten shares of that. Um, 10 shares of that is 50 bucks, I think. Uh, estimated amount 50 bucks, yep. And then um, I want buy a limit order, um, execute. I don't want to take profit just yet, but if I wanted to take profit, I can set that here. So if it goes up to $5.05, I take profit. If it goes, if it drops down between, uh, if it drops down to nine to $4.95, I want to cut my losses and run away. So you can set that up here, but I don't really care for that now. Um, and so that's looking good. And then I can say place order. <clears throat> Unfortunately, uh, regular trading hours has ended. If you would like to place this order, please select the extended hour tab. So let's go back. Um, and then, so instead of day here, we'll select extended hours. Oops, sorry. So extended hours. Yes. So it is looking like that. Um, so by placing this trade, um, so we can say confirm, let's see, we're buying up oh, is asking for my password and then confirm. So there you go, guys. We just placed uh, an order to buy 50, um, sh uh, 50 shares of um, ET um, energy transfer um, at $5 a piece. So um, in, in this case, uh, this order is going to execute once this stock hits $5. Um, and then we'll, we'll see what happens going from there. So that's just how easy it is for you to be able to invest your first $100. So I did invest at 50, but if you have $100, you can pick whichever stocks that best fit your need and invest uh, that $100 into using Webull. And again, it's commission free. Um, you don't pay anything when you buy, you don't pay anything when you sell. Um, that's just the bottom line. And then again, if you, if you're just starting out, if you use the link uh, in the description below, you get two free stocks. Again, like I said, one for just opening an account and then another stock for you when you deposit into the account, which is, which is awesome. So definitely take advantage of that. That's it guys. So, um, question of the day, uh, what do you think about this platform? Do you think that it's too complicated or do you think, oh my God, um, there's so many of them. I don't know which one to choose. Let me know in the comment section. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, we talk about how to make money, how to uh, save money, how to invest money, how to build wealth. And if that's something that really interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell because YouTube tells me that 90% of you guys watching haven't already subscribed to the channel. And as always guys, stay motivated.